Interest rates hit a 27 year high this week and we again matched our all time high for the median price of detached houses sold here in San Diego County. My name is Rob Martin. I'm with Compass. Obviously, I'm fresh back from Portugal. We got a lot cooking, so grab your favorite port. Let's check it out. So in June, we saw a spike in inventory as I referenced here. And with that said, I noted then and I'll note today, we only have one and a third months of inventory. So even though we saw that big spike and it felt like something more, the reality is, is that we are still in a very strong seller's market. And our inventory today has stabilized. We sit at about 1,600 detached houses available for sale in the county. Now, with that said, compared to 2021, we're not selling a lot of houses. In 2021, we were selling about 2,000 houses a month. And today, we're selling, this year, we're selling between 12 and 1,400 houses per month in San Diego County. But coming down from the 6 million units that we sold in 2021 to last year, when across the country we sold about 5 million homes across the country. And this year we were only on track to sell about 4.3 million homes. But just this past week, the National Association of Realtors came out and said, hey, we are going to finish this year strong. We are actually going to sell about 4.85 million homes across the country. And what that means is the following. If you have tight inventory as we have here in San Diego County, and even though we have a slowdown in sales from last year, if we're still selling those homes very quickly, as we are here in San Diego County, and you have people who still want to own in San Diego County, and now across the country, we're seeing that one out of every four homes that are purchased. Actually, 26% of all homes sold across the country are being sold for cash only. People paying 100% cash and not getting financing. When you have that type of competition for cash and you have interest rates at a 27 year high, well, if you're a buyer or you're a seller and if you're selling your home and somebody says, I will pay you all cash, you know that that deal is going to close. But if somebody's financing, you know that there's a little bit of a risk that maybe their loan doesn't go through. So you're going to command a little bit more. And as a result, we continue to see people compete with cash offers by having to offer a little bit more. And as a result, we're still seeing that our houses here in San Diego County are selling for about $20,000 more than their list price. And I will continue to emphasize this. If you're looking to buy a home in San Diego County and today you can afford to buy a home in San Diego County, it's the time to buy a home. And if you're thinking about selling, well, heck, why not sell at all time highs? If you have questions about the market or are curious about pricing, please let me know. You can reach out to me any way you'd like. And if you're interested to know what condos and townhomes are doing and also the exact number for houses, you can always look down below in the comments. And you can even go back and reference previous videos as well to get that same information for those months as well. I hope you have a super Southern California weekend. Again, my name is Rob Martin with Compass. Hope you like this video. Thank you.